Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. It's been a while since we've done a skincare routine, so I wanted to put y'all on to what I've been doing for my skin. Now I'm not gonna lie, it's been a while since I took some time to really care for my skin, as y'all can see by my eyebrows, because they are a little crazy, okay? Um, so this is my normal skincare routine, especially when I'm dermaplaning my face and getting rid of that peach fuzz. So to do that, I use a soothing aloe vera gel, and it helps the razor guide beautifully over your skin. So we're just going to go ahead and apply a little thicky layer on our face just so that way we can get ourselves prepped for shaving. Now you can either go in with a short razor or a longer razor like I'm using but the trick to a beautiful cut is to pull your skin so kind of like your skin is taut and just glide that razor down you don't have to do one long stroke you can just do a little mini strokes like y'all can see and you're going to get that satisfying shave when you turn the plate Next, we're going to clean things up with the facial cleanser. I'm using an ultra gentle cleanser by the brand Pharmacy. I don't use a lot of this, and as y'all can see, this is a small bottle, but I've been using this for quite some time, um, so a little definitely goes a long way with this product. Now, after we've wet our face and removed that cleanser, I like to go in with a paper towel and pat dry my face. Definitely don't want to use a towel and rub your skin because that can cause irritation. That's definitely something that you don't want, especially after you've shaved your face. Next, we're going to follow up with the toner, and the toner that I'm using is by the brand Ordinary. And it's obviously to help tone that skin on your face, along with removing any leftover dirt that may be lingering after you've cleansed it with your cleanser. Now, if you do have sensitive skin, I wouldn't recommend this, this toner in particular um, because it will sting your face a little, especially after you've shaved. Um, but I don't really have sensitive skin, especially on my face, so the burning sensation it doesn't really bother me. And if it gets a little too intense, then I just go ahead and fan it for a few seconds, which you guys will see. Now, onto our serums. I'm going to be using the Vitamin C Hibiscus Infused Serum by Teamy. As you guys can see, this is a new bottle, so we did have to do a little re-up, but this is a serum that I'm going to be applying after my toner. And with this serum here, I really do like it because it doesn't just give your skin the appearance of brighter and tighter skin, but it also helps add moisture into your skincare routine because of the hyaluronic acid. Now with some serums during your skincare routine, it leaves your skin kind of sticky. I didn't get that with this product, so thank God, because especially after shaving your face, it just helps soothe it. Um, so there's no stickiness with this product, but next I'm going to be using my skin roller and as y'all can see it's exactly what it's called I don't know if that's a technical term, but I'm going in with my facial skin roller and we're just going to roll any diagonal upwards motion So that way we can get the thin layer of serum that I left behind absorbed into our skin And I also roll this on my face so that way I can get more of a structured look to my face as well Okay, so for the last thing for our face, I'm going in with my absolute favorite moisturizer to finish everything off. This is by Peter Thomas Roth, and this is the Water Drench Hyaluronic Cloud Cream Moisturizer. Now, you can see that I do, again, have a small jar of this. I actually bought this from Nordstrom as a set a few months ago, and this is one of the products where a little goes a long way, like you really do not need a lot. The amount of moisture that you'll get from this product, it's insane. Like, you can literally just look so poreless, especially with that moisturizer. That is why I love it, but this is my skin after... Last but not least, we're going to hit our lips with some of that Vaseline because I am a chronic lip biter. I really do hope y'all enjoyed this video and found it helpful. Please be sure to subscribe and follow me on Instagram and I will see you guys in the next video.